Yeah, it's Papa Play Boys. It's your boy Sean back again with another video. Today's a sponsored video by Brink and Brake Lights. Shout out to Jeff for sending me these bad boys right here. I almost dropped them before I even like, got to put them on the car. But you guys, if you guys remember from my last video, not my last video, but my last uh, sponsored video, I had uh, installed some Brick and Brake Lights for the tail lights, right? And now, Jeff hit me up for some new ones that go in a spoiler. So if you guys looking for like, you know, a little, little, little pedaz in your little car, you feel me? Just go down to brinkandbreadlights.com and buy you a set. It's only $40 and they fit the FB6. I don't know about the 8th gens, but I know for the FB6 and uh, probably FG2s. No, FG4s, my bad. FG2s are the 8th the gens, but for the FG4s, I think they fit those two, but I'm not sure. But you guys can check. But yeah, man, we're gonna get these shits installed. I got my homeboy right here helping me record today. Say, yer. Yeah. So, he gonna be the cameraman for today. So this install could be a little easier for me because it's, as you guys seen from the last one, I had a GoPro and it made no sense, but hey, you gotta do what you gotta do, but let's get it. All right, so what you're gonna need for this install is literally a screwdriver. I hope that's it, don't really know. We'll find out when we get this done, but just need a screwdriver and literally there's two screws under your third brake light. Well, your square brake light is one here and the other one's right here. They're pretty tight. So uh, if you have a drill, it makes it easier for you guys to get it out. But I just got a screwdriver right now. So it's gonna take a little force. See, he's still not spinning, so. Come on, come on. Six and a half hours later. Come on! Stop it. Get some help. All right, I'm trying this one. All right, see, this one's coming out. This one's kind of, kind of being a strong motherfucker. No, I don't mess with you, bro. Come on! Stop treating me like that. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go get a drill. You guys know what time it is. I got the big drill. That boy coming out today. so hard. Alright, so let's try this again. We got a longer, uh, uh, I forgot what these things are called, but I got a longer one of those. So, as I was saying, what you want to do is just wanna take, take out these two screws, get in there. Yeah. Take out one, and then the other one's right here. the second one and after that everything is really simple you want to pull out the the third brake light without breaking it there we go and then uh let's see where's that cord if i remember exactly it's like All right, so basically what you guys want to do after you get your third brake light out, you want to get this end, stick it into whatever this is called, this part of your uh, tail light, and then you stick the other end into this side, and then boom, very simple. And now it's like that. Now it's time to test it out. And all you have to do is just step on the brakes to see if they work, and that's it. Hey, what? And then after that, you just do the re-steps. The, 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 uh, well, how you call it, the, you know. And the reverse. The reversal. Like the, oh, you see that one? Oh, you do one of those. Oh, you, no. Also, you could, uh, if you guys want, he sends out a little 3M5. You can stick it to the back of here, and you can stick it to the top of your spoiler and it'll keep this from like moving and going crazy while you're driving but i don't think it's really necessary it's just something if you want to do just to ease your mind but actually i think i might do it i don't know let's see stick it to the layer 
Let's take it to the office. Look right there. All right, cool. this part of the car. I just noticed that. What the hell, Honda? Uh -huh. Aha. <clears throat> Alright, you guys. So, you guys see how the brake lights look on the car. They look beautiful. Something different if you really want to, you know, give your car a little padaya when you, when you feel me, when you step on the brake. <laughs> if you guys need to purchase a set, please go to brakeandbrakelights.com or go to his Instagram and uh, you can purchase it. You can purchase it from there. They are $40, then they do make it, well, he does make it for the knife gen. So it's really different that a lot of people on the street have these, because it's really just like something brand new. You don't really see people doing it. So if you really want your car to be different, and you don't want to be like a basic person and get the regular tail lights, you get one for your third spoiler. And they make it for the S2000. So if anybody here who watches my video has an S2000 and want something different, hit them up. It feels good to be a gangster. But yeah, man, that's gonna be it for the video. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. The boys out. Peace.